Will you be continuing the Not So Berry Challenge? Yes, Not So Berry is coming on Wednesday, so you can expect it then. Chips and salsa. Oh my god, love that too. Love, love, love. Okay, Nikita, babe. You're really tired. You've got work in 17 hours at this point. Just go to sleep, you know? There's just no point in trying to stay up. How crusty? Crusty, babes? Crusty? Crusty. Oh my god, I, lo I actually love crusty. Crusty is actually the best cat. Like, I don't even care what anybody says. Crusty is so cute. I love crusty. <laughs> I've been enjoying it loads, just waiting for more whimsy. It's coming this week. It's coming, it's coming. Episode one of season three came out, but I need to finish off the rest of the series or the season. Okay, go go pee. Look at you, Krusty, you adorable bean. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my god, Krusty's coming into the toilet to wait for us. She's literally showing Krusty out. What's wrong with you? No, don't be horrible to Krusty. Give Krusty some love. Off a friendship. By the way, Lauren, loving the red lips. It just gorge. Thank you so much, Mrs. Dread. I appreciate you. Mmm. <laughs> hey, see Zinger ch uh, crisps, jelly babies, and a drink. That sounds really good. I love that. Here we go. Right, what's the time? It's uh, 7 a.m. She's got work in 12 hours. Oh, okay. We've got some um, we've got some weed to collect. There we go. And um, I'm gonna send her back to bed so she gets like a full night's rest. I can't change Krusty's food out because I don't have a bin. I should probably get one, right? Should I just get one? Sunny with the extended ooh, with the extended tier one sub through to April. That is crazy. That's so long. Thank you so 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 much, Sunny. That's like nearly a year, right? That's nearly a year, I think. Guys, could we get some claps, love, and hype in the chat for Sunny? How crazy is that extended tier one sub? Thank you so much. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like it's a smart idea to get a bin right now, right? Um, I need a really crusty looking one though. I feel like this is the only crusty looking bin. Do I put it like behind my... That would look weird though. What bin would she have? I'll probably... um. What's that? Does it come in brown? Yeah, that could work. This could work. I don't mind that. Like, she literally got some, like, weird old barrel and just, like, put it together. I don't mind that. I can rock with that. <laughs> I need to get some use out of, um, Bahoo, because, uh, otherwise I'm never gonna get use out of that pack. <laughs> oh, spook, spook fest. Oh, it's, uh, Halloween tomorrow. Well, I can just use that as an excuse to go around to people's houses and steal from them. <laughs> so, I don't mind. I don't mind that. Um, let me go and clear out, uh, Krusty's food and then I'll replace it as well. How long are you live streaming for? Uh, we've got 50, uh, 55 minutes left. That's true, actually. Dump spots usually have, um, a, a, a bin for all residents, don't they? Okay. I need to vacuum these guys up. Why did it get so dirty in this house so quickly? Okay, well, I can't get rid of this guy. You've got to go though. Oh my god! Where? <laughs> I've never seen that. Wait. I have never seen that interaction. <laughs> I love that. That was so cute. I've actually never seen that. Why was that so cute? <laughs> um, what should we have? Pastry? Yeah, let's have a pastry. It's like one o'clock in the afternoon. Do you know when the next episode of Whimsy is going to go on YouTube? It'll be this week. I'm not. I'm not sure. Um. I'm not sure exactly what day, because this week I want to really concentrate on YouTube uh, videos and not so much on streams, um, just because last week it was all like the uh, the cottage living LP. I now like uploaded like like what like ten or fifteen episodes of that, so I really want to focus on um really want to focus on YouTube uploads this week. Mm. I'm losing nuts. I know, <laughs> I know. Check them out. Have we got, have we got, we've got mail. Crusty, where are you going? Crusty, where are you going, babes? Crusty, honey. Oh my god. Oh my god. Crusty's come to break up, beat up Frankie. Wait, I actually, I actually think Crusty's come to beat up this, uh, this guy. Oh my god, not Crusty. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, I thought he was running away too. I was like, come on, Crusty, don't do this to me. 
Don't do this to me today. Um. Hmm. Oh, look, she's using her chopsticks. Nice. Love that. Um, what do I need to do? Okay, I need to get mystery skill up to level five. We should probably do some more pickpocketing. We need to have a declared enemy. You know what I should do? I should go over to Stevie's house and declare her my enemy officially. I want to make sure that she officially knows that she's my enemy. <laughs> Not her laughing like a maniac to herself. <laughs> He's a prowler. Yeah, but it doesn't mean he has to go beat up people, right? Is Stevie still living there? Oh my god. Who had all these kids? Who's this random guy too? Who are these? Who are these people? Actually, no. Who are these people? I think people got married in there. Oh, okay. Wait, where's Coda? Wait, Coda's not living there anymore? And neither is, um... Neither is, um, the other guy. Uh, Nick. That's weird. Okay, well, Stevie lives there, so. Oh, we got married, didn't he? Of course he did. I can't believe Coda's already moving on. Like, I didn't even get to shoot my shot with him. <laughs> Coda and Nick knew what Nikita did. What did she do? Hmm? What did she do? She needs an angry poop. Re release some of that negative energy. <laughs> okay, Stevie, where the hell are you, babes? I'm about to beat you up. Oh, actually, I do need to get into a fight. Well, you know, I can make the most of this time and beat her up. <laughs> oh, Lennon. Okay. Hi, Stevie. Yeah, come on in, huh? Should I just go over there and straight up fight her? Oh, it's neighborhood brawl day as well. Well, maybe we'll just make the most of neighborhood brawl day. Let me just uh, quickly beat you up. Yep. Stevie, get messed up. She's so angry, like, all the time. Girl, calm down. Ooh. Alvetta, huh? Guys. Um, She has a thing for Alvetta. I mean, I have a thing for Alvetta, so same though. <laughs> yeah, I'm on with that. I'm on board. Um, Declare enemy. Here we go. Officially, I'll make sure she knows she's my enemy. Did she lose? Oh no, she won. Nice, nice, she won. Why are you hugging her? I'm about to declare her my enemy. <laughs> Was that like on a friendship term? Like, yeah, you won the fight. Yeah, well now you're my enemy. <laughs> Take that money. Oh my god. Stevie and Nikita have had it. They are now enemies. Officially. And now she's gonna go over there and chat with her. I love that. And you're gonna go be mean to this. Why are you gonna go be mean to Carolina? Like, what the actual hell? Can we flirt with Alvesha though? Because like, Alvesha's kind of cute. And like, I'll be on board with that. Mm. Maybe we could be friends with Alvesha. And then it like moves into a relationship. That might be cool. Mm. Hat with neighbor. Gossip about neighbors. Let's gossip about Stevie. Let's talk about Stevie. Yeah, Stevie's a real bee. Haven't <laughs> um, you seen her? Um. Their children are starving. Guys, your kids upstairs are stuck. Oh my god, look at them. They're like packed in like little sardines in there. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, did they know? They're held because of this thing? Oh, okay. Guys, your kids are going to get taken away. Wait. Is that her husband? Oh my god. Sorry, Carolina ended up with like the best guy for her. Like, I can definitely, <laughs> I can definitely see them being together, though. Mm. Okay, well, look, I don't want to talk to Stevie anymore. I want to talk to Alvesa. Where'd she go? Here we go. If you're near her, you're just going to be pissed off. Okay, could we... Alvesa, could you just, like, come away with me? Wait, call a, call a smitch? Wait, can I call Stevie a smitch? Because she actually was, though. She did actually, she did actually snitch on me. I want to call her a smitch, drama. Call her a smitch, yeah. You're a, you're a, you're a, um, you're a smitch. <laughs> She's naked, yeah, I know, I don't know why. <laughs> okay, go on, call her a snitch. Or a smitch, sorry. Yeah, I installed a new crib. 
Because I was sick and tired of babies just like chilling everywhere, like in people's houses. There we go. Okay, I think I've got it out with her. Wait, apparently I didn't get into another fight. Damn it. Okay. Um, hmm. I've got a good idea. Should I take out... Where's that, that guy that I met yesterday? Luca. I really like him. I'm considering bringing him out with me to go... Um, um, to go meet people and also to go and uh, rob from people. <laughs> Hi, Lacey. Welcome back to the stream. I want to go over to rich people's houses and I want to steal from them. So I'm going to let him come with me. Box glove. They'd probably be pretty rich. Um, Raven. They look pretty rich too. Probably these guys are the richest, right? Oh, these ones are probably really rich as well. Oh, they're definitely rich. Yeah, let's go over to this one. For sure they're rich. Look at them. Who made Luca? It was Erin, of course. <laughs> It'll be a great bonding experience for them. I thought it'd be like, you know, we could just go and steal stuff together and we could really bond, you know? <laughs> that household and kids and babies, all of it. <laughs> what if she became a witch and did bad magic? I don't really want to go into the whole supernatural side of things, or at least not yet. Oh my God. Oh my god, look at him looking like an absolute god. Oh my goodness. Okay, um, hmm. I'm just going to uh, ask if single. She's too angry to do this. Damn it, okay. <laughs> Get them sleeves, Lauren. Oh my god, yes. Nikita needs more tattoos now. I didn't give her too many because she was a teenager before. But I can give her all of her tattoos again. I want to give her face tattoos too. I'm being so productive, Lauren, folding my clothes while watching the stream. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> the guy looks like a villain from a series of unfortunate events. He deserves to be robbed. He does. He does. Now, okay, I'm in their house and I'm really hoping that there's going to be something worth a lot of money in here. What about the TV? No, can't steal that yet. What about this stuff? Ooh. Ooh. What's these? Oh, these look like they're displayed. Does that mean they're really expensive? Wait, what about the computer? Can I steal this? Attempt to swipe? How do I do that? No, there's no attempt to swipe option on it. Needs higher mischief skill? Damn it. Okay, so can I swipe paintings yet then? No, not that one. Let me go upstairs. I love how random people just invite me into their house and then I just come in here and like steal all their stuff. Like, how do they not suspect that this random woman who's just knocked on their door and is going snooping around their house is not stealing their stuff? Like, really? You must have some sort of idea. <laughs> she needs to buy protection. She already has some, doesn't she? Yeah, she has the, um, she has the, uh, the the condoms on her the, oh, sorry the, not condoms they're um the parachutes guys we're family friendly here sorry um oh this no i can't have that what can i get the cooker nope um anything have you have you got anything in here anything i can steal this no this they don't have anything i can steal that painting by the bathroom Wait, which one? Did you mean this one here? That one there? It's good money. Wait, this one here? Oh, it is, isn't it? Oh my god, I wish I could have that. <laughs> Can you swipe the lamps on the desk? That's so bad, though. I'm ca Oh, Have I really got to come around here and swipe this stuff? Like, that's just so... That's just so lame. That's... Okay, I'm going to take this. It is actually really pretty. I'll just take that. Whatever, fine. I'll take that home. <laughs> What if Le Lennon tries to get in contact with Nikita because they both have gone through teenage pregnancies? Because often you end up as friends with people you hate at first. That is really true, actually. Could be like a little redemption story for them. <gasps> yes, Mischief Skill Level 4. And she can now become partners in crime with other Sims. Um, okay, so I want her to become partners in crime with another Sim. Who do you think out of like her friendships would she become partners in crime? Or should I save it and have her like make a really good friend, like one of her girlfriends and do it then? Or should I, or should I, uh, or should I have her become a partner? I don't know, maybe not Luca. I mean, they are currently partners in crime with Krusty. I'm actually all for that, though. <laughs> uh, we should go and pickpocket somebody while we're here, though. Let's see if there's anybody walking along the streets. Hold on, wait up, sir. Stuart. 
please wait up. <laughs> Let me come and try and pickpocket him. Go on. Nikita, run. Run, Nikita. Oh my god, why are you walking like that? Like, actually, why why are you walking like that? Okay, she's fine now. She's fine. <laughs> save it for someone else. Yeah, I want to save him. Here we go, right? She's going to try and steal from the... Wait, wait. The strat. The strat is to, to give them a friendly introduction first. Hold on. Well, wait. Don't do that. Don't do it yet. 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 Oh, my God. It's because you didn't say hello first. It was too sus. Oh, my God. You were so sus about it. Like, look at you. You're such an embarrassment. <laughs> Hi, unicorn. Don't even worry about it. Give her a girl BFF who's her partner in crime. Okay. Out of the people that she knows right now, who would be her BFF? Because Stevie, I mean, she's long gone. So it's not going to be Stevie. We've got Emiko, Carolina, Lennon, um, Alvetta. I mean, she did kind of like Alvetta, didn't she? She had a thing for Alvetta. So that would, that would be a good idea too. Oh my God, her daughter as well. Interesting. Who do we think so far? You guys think Lennon? Alvetta most definitely. Okay, what about Lennon and Alvetta? Can we have two? Can we be like a little trio of like people like stealing? And they've all got colored hair. They've all got pink in their hair. So it must be a thing, right? <laughs> Lauren, can I ask what module you took out of the Woohoo Wellness mod? It is the um, the risk and protection module. And then because you remove that one, you also have to remove the WTDs as well. You have to remove both of those. Um, but as soon as you remove them, it works again. Bring somebody new. Oh, we could actually pick from some of you guys' new sims and have a be friends with one of those. Let me check. Um, let me just check if there's anybody in the manage world section that we can have a be friends with. Nikita's success rate is at five percent. Isn't this her job? Look, okay. She she's good at stealing from people's houses. She's not so good at pickpocketing from people. You know, it's just, mm. it's just. Mm. <laughs> um, right. So for people that she could steal from. Oh, okay, so Jackson, probably not going to be her partner in crime. Probably going to be, like, her enemy that she's going to, um, st you know, still with. Sue Jin is definitely an option. I could see her. She's really sweet. Oh, my God, Rose. Rose. Maybe. Maybe Rose? What do you guys think? I could put Rose in somewhere. What do we think about Rose? Definitely good potential for partner in crime here. We need a drug dealer. We've already got a drug dealer. Let me put Rose in the world just so that we have a chance of meeting her too. Um, Where should I move her in? I probably have to move it in with someone. Oh my god, Nick! I can't even believe Nick lives with somebody. He's married. What the actual hell? Um, Any of these apartments free? Not a single one of them is free. Not a single one. Okay, maybe you just move in with these guys. There you go. At least you get a house. Take what you can get. I still think Lennon and Alvesa. I mean, admittedly, we know Lennon and Alvesa, so I feel like it's a good start, you know? I can I can still see it being a thing with Lennon and Alvesa. I mean, what do I do? Do I invite them somewhere? Maybe Nikita. Maybe in her mind, right? She's got like an idea that she needs to reconcile with some people. She knows right now that she has no friends. She needs some friends on her side. One, to get more friends. She needs the ability to... She wants to go into drug dealing, doesn't she? So she needs a really big client base. So she needs to be able to do that for one. And two, maybe she wants to turn everybody else against Stevie. I think that might be a good opportunity as well. Stevie is now officially her enemy. So maybe it'd be nice to like get with the people who are all friends with Stevie and turn them on her. Like, sh like Stevie turned everybody else on her. Maybe she could try it. <laughs> uh, Nick Lass with the hydrate as well. Start up her redemption story and maybe Luca push her towards making up as he thinks she can do better or be better. That's a really cute story as well. I kind of like that. Should I invite them out somewhere? I could invite Luca as well. Maybe Luca can help. Right, Lennon. See, look, she has bad relationships with all of them. It's because she's gone around and told everybody about us though. Right, I'm not sure that they're actually going to come, but I'll invite. I'm not sure. Oh, she starts working. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. She's got work in one hour. So, oh, um, she needs to do some more mischievous interactions. Um, 
let's find somebody on the streets. <laughs> Wait, this guy, right? Uh, let me come do some mischievous interactions to him. Hold on. Oh, she can pickpocket again. Let me try. Maybe she could meet some co-workers. There could be someone she already knows and become her partner in crime. That's a really good idea as well. I think she already knows some of her co-workers. I think some of these are her co-workers. What are you doing? You're supposed to be you're supposed to be pickpocketing this guy. Not crying. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Go pickpocket. Oh, give him a, um, give him a mean introduction first. Oh wait, no friendly introduction. Sorry, we have to be like not sus. Don't be sus. Give him a friendly introduction. Maybe throw more parties and make new friends and build clientele. Yeah, we need to. I need to invite everybody over to my house and like try and just like build relationships with them. In her way, I can imagine she's doing it for like to build her drug clientele. Um, but actually she doesn't really want to be friends with them. <laughs> but she knows that she's going to be in a really bad space if she doesn't make friends with people. So, I think, yeah, I think it's a really good idea. Maybe, right, okay, so we've given him a snooty introduction. That's just going to go down great. Now I'm going to try and steal from him. <laughs> okay, let me try. Let me try. Quick, you've got work in 11 minutes. Make the most of it. Go, go, go. Oh, no, we caught us. No. Oh, okay, she's got to go to work now. Never mind. You can have a part where you can see all your co-workers if you met them. Just like the pets thing. Oh, yeah, you do. You have that option, don't you? Yeah, you do, actually. Hi, Nana Hall. Welcome back from your lurk. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, sorry. I was just reading, uh, reading the message from the mod creator. How do you sort out the Woohoo Wellness and Wonderful Whims mod? So there's a module in it called the Risk and Protection module. You just have to remove that one. Um, oh, suck up to bosses. Make connection. Lowers work performance but fills social need. That one might be a good one to do. I mean, I feel like I should be having her work hard though because she's pretty close to getting a promotion. So let's just have her work hard. Actually, we're already at level four. And we've got like ages until she becomes an adult. So we don't actually really need to push for it that much. I might have her just try and make connections today and see if she can like get her relationship up with her co-workers. I don't know if that's actually what it's going to do. So yeah, co-workers. Okay, so, oh, right. So all these people are people that she works with. So she works with um, Coda, Ricardo and Carolina. And I think her relationship is going up with them while she's, yeah, she's like interacting with them. Yeah, look, like, because they're moving. She's like, oh, she's pretty good friends with Carolina right now. Yeah, she's pretty good friends with her now. Hi, Dolly. Has she met my sim yet? I have not been here in a bit. Um, I don't know what happened. Who was your sim, Dolly? What was the name of them? What was going on? Why are you... Oh, yeah, she doesn't like being at work, does she? Oh, her and Carolina are getting a really good, like, relationship together. I love that. Uh, she swiped an object at work. My queen. I love that for you. Um, oh, I've got an idea. Maybe instead of... Um, instead of, like, staying in tonight, let's invite Carolina out. Let's invite her out to, like, a bar or something. Because um, it might be good to have a friendship with her. And I can give her a makeover because she needs some clothes because she's always walking around naked. <laughs> um, but this is a good opportunity. Oh, let me grab Alberta and Lennon as well. Um, I'm gonna invite them all out for like a little little party or something. Like not a party, okay, not a party, but like a night out. <laughs> I'm sad that Coda got married. I wanted to see them be a thing. Um, I don't think they were ever gonna get married, honestly. I did never see them getting married. Um, I could definitely see them. I could definitely see them, um, you know, like having a relationship, but not getting married. I don't really see that myself. Um, I want like a nightclub or something. That's a lounge. Gym. Mm, what about Del Sol Valley? These are for the famous people though, right? I don't think the riffraff can get in here. <laughs> okay, not these then. Uh, where else would there be some good stuff? Willow Creek maybe? Mm -mm. There's no like good bars that I felt like they would go to um mm, no no evergreen harbor maybe 
Like a really rundown bar. Oh yeah, the caboose. Yeah, yeah, let's go to the caboose. I actually quite like this bar. Could Coda be an accidental baby daddy? She's literally gonna have so many accidental baby daddies. We can't do this. <laughs> I feel like Coda should be a BFF now instead of a love interest since he's married. I feel like they could be good friends. I mean, that is certainly an option for them to be, you know, good friends. Um, we could potentially be a bit of a homewrecker and like sleep with him whilst he has a wife. I don't know if he'd be into that though. Did nobody else come with me? Looks like no one, no. Looks like no one could make it. No, no, you're lying. You're actually lying. Maybe it's because they're actually still at work. Caroline is probably still at work, right? Oh, they're all sleeping. Oh. Well, no, 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 no. They work with me. No, they don't get to sleep. Sorry, you've got to come. <laughs> you don't get to sleep on my watch. What is this? Alvesa, you're coming too. And who was it? Lennon? Yep, you're all coming. Here you go. We're having a nice night, okay? Where are they? I'm not sure where they're going to turn up. There they are. Okay. Right. Let me grab them all in a group. We're going to go grab some drinks. Okay. So just join my group. I can't believe Caroline is naked. I need to get, <laughs> I need to get her a, um, I need to get her some clothes. Here we go. Right. Let me call them in. I'll buy them drinks as well. Look, I'm even going to buy you guys drinks. Expensive ones too. Um, sea splashes. Look at this. Expensive. And now with the hydrate as well. Thank you so much. Where's, where's the other girl? Oh, Lennon. There you go. Lennon, uh, nah. Oh, fine. I'll buy you a drink. Whatever. Fine. I'm trying to make friendships here. Come on. Come inside. <laughs> Nikita is literally like a problematic aunt. Plenty of husbands and abortions. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no. That's too good. Okay, Lennon's in here. I'm going to try and make up with you guys. Listen. Okay, I've not been, just, I bet you she's just gonna try and be rude to Lennon, like just naturally. Look, guys, I really wanna like make a fresh start with you all. You know, um, I know what Stevie's told you. I don't know what she's told you, you know, but she she made me look really bad. And honestly, like, you know, um, it wasn't even, it wasn't even that big of a deal, you know, like I, I didn't have any choice. I had to give my, I had to give my daughter up for adoption. It was gonna be a bad life for her. You know, I did it for her. I did it, I was thinking of her, you know, really. Um, Carolina, you being naked is really just putting me off, babe. So if we could just get dressed, that would be amazing. <laughs> Let me just give Carolina some clothes a second. Oh my god, badass girl club. Love that. Yeah, yeah, Stevie did snitch on her. So I'm gonna have her, gonna have to go back for, for that one. Right, formal. Oh, she's naked in like every outfit. Okay, right, we're gonna have to do some of her outfits. I can't be having my new bestie walking around naked, can't, can we? That can't be a thing. This is a formal wheel. Um, mm, kind of see her having like a really... Wait, she's, she's kind of homeless as well though. Um, I kind of see her wearing something like that. But that could be a party wheel. That could potentially be a party wheel. So formal. Maybe something like that. Yeah, I guess it's kind of formal. Maybe if her and Koda are good friends and Nikita is in a same-sex relationship, Koda could be a sperm donor. So we can still get his genetics. That could work too. That could definitely work. I don't know if um, Nikita's going to end up in a safe sex relationship as a final relationship, but I definitely see her being with a girl um, in this stage of her life. I don't know if she's going to end up with a girl at the final stage, though. I'm not sure. All black outfits for sure. Yeah, I was thinking the exact same thing. Um, this is her athletic wear. I'll give her like a little back dress. That's fine. Sleep wear. Um, doesn't really matter. We're not really going to see that, so we don't really mind. Party wear. I was thinking of... Where did, where'd it go? That dress that I put on her a second ago. The one where her, her bob was out. She had a little bit of bob out. <laughs> she would defo wear that. You saw the same thing as well. Where'd it go? Um, there we go. Yeah, this. Love that. And then... Some, uh, some shoes. These ones. Oh, if that didn't do that weird thing to her leg, they would have been perfect. Oh, those work too. I like that. Yeah, that's good. And then what do we got? This. We'll go for like a black one. That's fine. Hot weather wear. We don't really mind. I originally gave her that style like that, did you? See, we were on the same wavelength. 
Uh, hot weather wheel. Mm, no, it's not really a hot weather wheel. Let's go with some shorts. Um, this in black. Those work. Those with something. Anybody watch the Squid Game? Um, I don't like it, really. I really like Squid Game. I really did like it. But it was really good. Oh yeah, I like that outfit. That's nice on her. Then cold weather wear. I'll just give her like a, a black. Like, what does this one look like? That's actually pretty cool on her though. I actually really like that on her. I think I'm going to give that uh, to her for a cold weather wear. Yeah, I actually really like that outfit on her. She looks so cool. She's such a cool looking sim. Like, she's really cool looking. I think she's so cute. Oh, she does have green eyes, isn't she? I need to copy those those eyeballs over. Let me do it now. Um, what one she got? The middle ones. Let me just make sure I do that. If she's my friend, I feel like I should at least um, make sure she's not, not walking around naked. It would honestly be cruel of me to just leave her walking around naked with town, right? There you go. Make sure you got your contacts on, babe. There you go. Oh, I'm going to have to give her naturally green eyes underneath as well. There you go. I haven't watched Alice in Borderland, no, but I do really want to watch it. I need to watch it at some point. Fastest crazy sim I've seen you do. I was trying to get through it really fast because we've only got like 30 minutes left of the stream. And I really, really, really want to play through this. So <laughs> I feel like we haven't had mu that much playing time. I feel like Carolina is the oldest out of the ladies. I get the same impression too. I don't get the idea that she's like old, but she's definitely older. I feel like she's more vintage, maybe a bit more savvy too, you know? That was a bomb makeover in less than three minutes. That's a record girl. Would you get proud of me? See, I can do it when I want to. <laughs> I feel like I am. Um, I wish I just use the same outfits all the time though, if I do that. Oh, Krusty, sorry, I've got to leave you again. I'm playing with Nikisa, sorry. <laughs> I finished an Alice in Borderland. It was really good. Was it? Is it worth the watch? She is just stunning. There's just something about Carolina that I just really love. She's just got this like look that none, like none of the other Sims have, I think. There's just something about her. <laughs> Hi, James. Welcome to the stream. Mm. Maybe I'm going to have to start watching Alice in Borderland as well then. Yeah, I did like Squid Game. Squid, Squid Game was good. I hope they haven't left yet. Oh no, they haven't. Great, okay. Um, let me make sure they're in my group then. Right, actions, add to group, add to group. Here we go. Uh, thank you for the follow, uh, Cerberus, I think it's. I think that's supposed to be an E. Thank you so much for the follow. Do you CC? Yes, uh, too much. <laughs> too much CC. Um, let me order all the guys some drinks then because I'm trying to I'm trying to make friendships with them You know, I'm trying to be a better person. Oh my god. Look at her. She's actually like just such a moody woman like, <laughs> like on. Why are you naked again? There's physically not an outfit that I left you naked in. That's not even possible There's no way. Oh She has a second outfit that she's naked in really you kidding me. There's one out. Oh my goodness Okay, right. Why don't you get in that outfit then? And Nikita, why are you in those ugly outfits? Like, get out of this ugly outfit. That's not you. Also, need to watch the new season of Shameless. I haven't seen that either. Uh, what outfit should we go for? Um, I normally like her in this outfit. That one's kind of cute one on her. Yeah, that's good. She really wants to be naked, right? Oh, does he have a thing for Carolina? I think he does. Okay, so Carolina is like one of our like closest friends now. We work like quite... Um, we work quite closely with her, so I'm going to talk to her a little bit more. But I feel like I need to I need to try and make up with these girls. So, um, what should I do? I'm going to compliment her personality. Say about how much you like her. She actually really likes Alvesta. She thinks Alvesta is really good looking. So I could see her actually complimenting her, you know, a little bit more. Um, let's talk about money with Lennon. I feel like Lennon would love money. Oh my god, go my boyfriend is taking me out on a date. First time on your stream and I loved it. Definitely um, gonna come back for more, but bye everybody. No worries, KCC. I hope you enjoy your date. It sounds really fun. <laughs> um, oh my god, look at all these kids. Oh my god, Winnie had a baby. Oh, I love that. Oh, Winnie having babies. Lauren, take pictures with them and put them on the wall. Yes, definitely. But I want to try to like work my... 
Okay, I don't really like using the pit like the picture taking thing to like get their relationship up because I feel like it's honestly a bit of like a hack to like get their relationship up and I don't really like it. I kind of like gradually progressing my relationship up, which honestly takes a long time. But I feel like I get to know them a little bit more, you know, and I actually make friends with them. So I'm gonna try doing that instead. I'm actually gonna sit here and try and talk to them <laughs> instead of just take pictures with them and be like, oh hey, now we're besties. <laughs> look, look, we're learning a bit more about them. We learned that Lennon is non-committal, so she's probably a bit like. Nikita in that way they're probably learning that they're all actually very similar in specific ways like probably Lennon um she's learned that Alvese really is into music which might be nice for them to like go to a rave or something together that would be cute um are you grabbing your drink oh yeah and she's grabbing some food too no no guys don't go don't go I'm not finished talking to you I'm not finished um asked to hang out oh my god I want to be Lennon Lennon is just freaking gorgeous isn't she uh, let me discuss interest with them. Let me talk to Carolina as well. Um, let me talk about interest. Yeah, discuss interest. Here we go. Sorry, I'm back. I had a couple of ads. That's okay. That's no worries. How were your ads? <laughs> were they good? Um, oh, hook up with? I can convince them to hook up with people. I love that. Blonde's about wealth. No, express materialistic thoughts. If she's really into money, right? She's really into money as well. I feel like they'd have like a thing going on with them wanting money yeah look at it look at their relationships this is not bad i'm actually proud of you look somehow you're not being completely cruel to everyone and i'm very proud of that right why don't you ask them about their lives like, ask them about their careers and things ask yeah what do you guys work as obviously carolina i know i know you you, you work with me so she's a oh lennon's a biochemist okay smart little queen i love that what about Alvesa? Alvesa, what do you do as a job? I didn't even get to talk to you about your career. Are you gonna ask Alvesa? Yeah? She, oh, I love Alvesa's, like, come on. Alvesa's style is just the best. Like, look how hot she looks. Oh my God, she works as an aquatic ecosystem tweaker at Future La Sims Lab. That is so cool, I love that. Ask her if she wants to hang out a bit more. I can stay for like a few more hours. Although I've got to go home soon because I think I'm working tomorrow. Oh no, I'm off. I'm off for tonight. Nice. She can hang out for a bit. Let me buy her another drink. Let me get her drunk. <laughs> they're definitely more likely to be friends with me when they're drunk. Um, I'll buy you a wrench. There you go. Look, look, I'm gonna buy you a drink. Please stay. <laughs> Please stay and be friends with me. I have no friends. <laughs> um, ask about her taste in music. Oh yeah, she's into music. See, that's a good thing to talk about. And then we're gonna give her a heartfelt compliment. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Yeah. Oh, okay, she just like listed everything to us. Love that for us. Have a deep conversation with them. Yeah, if they're drunk, they'd definitely be good friends, don't you think? I feel like they would be really good friends if they were drunk. Ask her if she's single. Well, she, he's, she's attracted to her, so it might be a good opportunity to ask if she's single as well. I love this. I love it. Um, mm -hmm. uh, did that guy just not give us our drinks? Oh, the bartender left. What is this about? Get back in there. I want my other drink. Tell her an engaging story. Keep her, keep her interested. Listen, I need a new bestie, okay? And I feel like me and you, we've got so much in common. Honestly, you're dead cute. So we work really well together. Like, you're attractive. I'm attractive. We could definitely <laughs> go into people's houses and steal things. <laughs> Please. Um, I don't know if she... Uh, would she want to be into, like... I, yeah. I, would she want to be into crime with us? She's not a criminal. She doesn't work as a criminal. But that doesn't necessarily mean that she wouldn't do crime with us on the side. You know? He took your money and dipped? Yeah, I think I paid for it too. Share? Share photos? I guess so. She wants to make another enemy? Why? And start an argument. Like, what is wrong with you? She does want to hug somebody. Can we try and hug it out? Like, imagine they go from hating each other, or not hating, but disliking each other, to hugging. Please, can we can we have that wholesome? I really want her to get together with Alvesta at some point. I really would love for her to have a relationship with her. I want them to start off as friends and then maybe like, you know, things start happening. I don't know if Alvesta finds um, like other girls attractive. I'm not sure if Alvesta is uh, bisexual or if she's straight, I'm not sure. So I need to try and find out, you know? I want to compliment, yeah, compliment her outfit. She looks so cool. Please compliment her outfit. She looks so good. Uh, compliment, there you go. Compliment Alfin. Ah, no, sir. <laughs> no, Mocha, I'm not gonna beat her up. Stop. <laughs> Stop, don't do that. We're not gonna beat her up, right? Right, guys, we're not gonna beat up our new bestie. Right, guys? 
right? And <laughs> discuss neighborhood changes. Oh, maybe you could talk to her about moving. Oh my god, I've got such a good idea. What about if Alveta? Wait, I don't know if she's. I don't know if she's married. I need to ask if she's single. Right, let me ask. If Alveta's not married, I think what would be really cool, right? Okay, what do you guys think? If I put Nikita's, um, I get like a big plot, right? I put Nikita's uh, trailer on the lot, and then I build a bunch of other trailers on the lot that I'm not actually going to pay for. I would like take them off my money, and then I'll have Alveta come and live in those trailers. So I'll take them all on as um, as like friends, like um, as as roommates, and then they can all stay in the other trailers around for me. So then Alveta could be like my roommate, but she's kind of like my trailer. Like they'd all live on the same like little neighborhood section as me. I feel like that might be a good opportunity. Right? I think like that'd be so cool, right? <laughs> I think that'd be so cute to like have them like all live close to each other. Um, okay, she learned that she's single, so that's kind of perfect. She doesn't live with like a husband or something. Okay, she's leaving. It's a good opportunity. We 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 did good. We did good. We did really good. <laughs> And they were roommates. <laughs> yeah, you like that idea? Oh my god, I didn't hear what Lauren said because I was so into chat. I said, what about if I build a... Um, so I move Nikita's trailer into like a bigger lot. And then I add a bunch of other trailers around, like in like a circle or something. I build like a neighborhood of trailers. And then I can have like my friends, like, you know, all of these friends that I'm getting. I can have them all come live on the trailers with me as roommates. So I'll like, I'll like, em not employ them. I'll open my thing as like a roommate and they can all come live on my lot with me. But they'd all live in their own trailers. They'll all have their own life going on. And then, you know, I could still be friends with them. I feel like that would be a good opportunity for her to do with Alveta. Maybe I can have some of the guys move in. Maybe like Luca as well. Luca lives in that really, sh like, I was, okay, I was just going to swear. Luca lives in that really shoddy house over here. Come on, like, I could build you a better trailer than that. Come on, like, I'm sure that's going to sell for like nothing. <laughs> you could come, you could come live with me. Um, well, she doesn't have work tomorrow, so I can just have her go straight to sleep and then uh, have a shower and then go straight to sleep. I've missed so much. He has a dog now. That's not a dog. That's a cat. But his name is Krusty. And honestly, he's so cute. I love him so much. <laughs> Meet Krusty. <laughs> Look how cute he is. Oh, we love Krusty. He's just such a such a mood. Nan Hall with the gifted sub. Thank you so, so, so much for the support, Nan Hall. Guys, could we get some claps, love, and hype in the chat for Nan Hall? Oh my god, Spookfest. Guys, it is... You know what? Since she's made some friends, she is so much happier. Every single day, she normally wakes up and she's so aggressive. She literally just chooses violence every day. She's actually being a, a better person gradually as she's like making friends. And I'm kind of here for it. Like, are you okay? Are you okay, Krusty? You know what? Let me just give Krusty a quick treat before I uh, before I go to bed. Be good, Krusty. Have, have a treat and then also give her a little pet too. <laughs> Lauren, you should do, do a stream where you build their trailers around their personalities. Sunny, I love that idea so much. That's actually a really good idea if we do a stream on that. I really like that. Like a little trailer park. Love it. <laughs> also, Nosy with the save reminder as well. Thank you so much. Maybe we'll have to set that up. Maybe on Wednesday stream, we could do the trailer park like renovation for her. Because I really would like her to move sometime soon. And I feel like we could move to Oasis Springs. Come down, Krusty. I want to give you some love. I'm here, Krusty. Oh my god, look a little Krusty. I love him. Honestly, Krusty, there's just something about him. We, yeah, I need to write this down for this week because we're going to forget. I should really write stuff down after my stream, shouldn't I? Should really start writing this. <laughs> Lauren, there's a gift to sub. Oh, sorry. Um, Nan Hall with another gift to sub as well. Thank you so much. Guys, could we get some more claps, love, and hype in the chat? I like how cramped and small her trailer is. I don't really anticipate on extending her trailer anymore. The only thing I was considering is adding like a bit out the front or a bit out the back. And I'm going to turn it into like a, um, into a weed room where she grows all of her weed. It's kind of going to be like um, a conservatory or like a greenhouse or something. Are you okay, Krusty, whilst he slowly dies of black mold infestation? Oh, Nikita just woke up and thinking about Luca. Okay, I see you. I see you thinking, okay, could we please move so I don't keep getting like spiders like wake me up at night because that's really annoying. <laughs> Krusty just sees the whole vibe. There's just something about Krusty that I love. Just something about him. Gonna go play some Sims on my own but still uh, going to watch the stream. No worries, Jada. 
make it a shack instead of adding to the trailer oh what a good idea like a, like an external shack like putting like a little shack here love that love that <laughs> imagine waking up to spiders crawling in your bed literally only her what was that sound oh was it because it got dirty in here yes because it's really dirty oh my god okay let me wake up oh my god i'm gonna i'm gonna vacuum it up no i can't vacuum it up okay go step on it then there you go it's gone it's gone. <laughs> oh my god. Right. Um, serve up dinner. Oh, grilled cheese. I can actually make some food. Oh, wait. The last time she made food, she set everything alight. So please don't do that again. Please don't. <laughs> the dust bunnies munching away. Wait, what do they... They don't actually munch, right? They don't actually take it. Why doesn't Krusty eat? What does, Krus what does Krusty eat, though? Because he never eats his food that I leave out for him. Do you think Nikita will clean the trailer anytime soon? What do you think? What's the bet? How many days until she cleans the trailer? <laughs> How many days do you think it's gonna take? Oh my god, look. Oh my god, look at that grilled cheese. <laughs> that is disgusting. Oh my god, look at that. She's such a bad cook. Um, oh, let me check if any of my friends are having children. Um, no, 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 no. Oh, Stevie. Stevie went and got herself knocked up with this vampire. Honestly, does not even surprise me. Dirty. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I mean, um, I mean, it's dirty that she's getting in with a vampire, but you know. It's Stevie. <laughs> She'll be in her grave before she cleans that trailer again. She literally did it once and she's like, no, never again. Krusty eats the gross food that Nikita doesn't eat. Does he really? Oh, let me go clean that up. Right, use the toilet. Um. Oh, it's... Oh no, I missed Halloween. No, I'm so disappointed. Okay, I'm gonna set up the party now. It's better late than never. She she honestly, she's on a, such a bad sleeping schedule because um because of her work that she sleeps at like random times. So we miss all the holidays during the day. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot it was Halloween. I wanna throw a Halloween party. Mm. Is there a costume party or have I gone past it? Yeah, I should call a maid again, right? That's actually a really good idea. Mm. Celebrate adoption? No. <laughs> no. Backyard barbecue, retirement, Christmas Eve. Oh, spooky party. There we go. Right, spooky party. The host is going to be Nikita. The guests should bring crusty. No, no, it's fine. Um, right. So I want to bring my co-workers. I should probably invite all my co-workers over, right? Uh, Carolina, Kai, Coda, Ivor. Uh, I should give these guys makeovers. I should give the other guys makeovers. I feel like. Let me uh, let me invite those because we're kind of close to all of them. Be right back. Gonna switch laundry. That's okay. <laughs> Um, and then we're gonna need some more simmies. Luca, of course, can come. He's not married, Jay, is he? No. Lauren, it's almost time. Okay, I've got 10 minutes, it's fine. I'm making the most of it. <laughs> uh, Alex, I don't like that guy, so he can't come. Um, who else am I missing? Mindy, I don't really know that. That's the guy that I work with. Alveta, of course, she can come. We've now actually got a friendship with her, so yeah. Oh, the new girl, Archer. Oh, it's a bit weird to invite her because she's like she's like um the mean rich girl, so it'd be weird to invite her. But she, I will um I will let her come at some point. Um, yes, our drug dealer. I feel like it's I feel like it's only right to invite your drug dealer to the party. Like, imagine you don't invite your drug dealer to the party. Like, that's just messed up. Um, I'm missing loads of Sims. I think they're like all together. Um, Nina, yeah, we haven't met her yet, so we need to bring her. Stevie, oh, Stevie's married. Oh, Stevie's married to a deadly vampire. Okay, sure. <laughs> oh my god, Nasette as well, cute. Um, uh, Elias, I haven't met him yet. Where's all the rest of them? Nick, okay, Nick's not coming. <laughs> Sorry, Nick. Oh, Lennon, yes. We're finally friends. 
Anybody else? I think that's it. I think I've got everybody. Hi, Brooke. Welcome to the stream. Where's the manners in not inviting our drug dealer? Exactly. It's honestly mean not to invite your drug dealer. Like, you can't even do that. Uh, and I think that's everybody. I don't think I'm forgetting anybody. Carolina. Um, I invited her. I invited her already. Yeah, there she is. Right, okay. Let me bring them. I'm not gonna... I, I will bring a mixologist, though. I'm gonna hire one of those. Where do we throw it? Um, we should probably throw it actually at a specific place, right? Maybe a nightclub? We could always go to the same place that we went to last time. It wasn't a bad place, and it's literally just over the road. I feel like it's a good place to go to. What do you guys think? The one over the road? Oh, well, actually, there's a secret bar. Uh, no, it doesn't really suit the whole look, though, does it? Yeah, I got Lennon. Lennon's coming, don't worry. Yeah, let's just go over to the one over the over the road. We'll throw it for now. Perfect. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah. I, I wait, I don't think I have enough drugs like uh collated yet to be able to sell any. I think I need like five more uh buds to be able to like put them in the jar. So once I've done that, I'll be able to actually start selling. This time you meet to need to meet uh Nina. She embarrassed me last time though. Nina danced so weird last time at the party. I was like, don't embarrass me in front of chat. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. What did she dress as? Oh my god, she's a witch! Oh my god, wait. I think I like- Do I like this outfit on her? I'm not sure. What other outfits have we got? What's the choices? Mm, wear costume. Maid, um... Oh, villain. Let me see her in the villain costume. Honestly, it's like her, her look. Uh, doesn't really look very villainous though, does she? Um, what other options have we got? Villain, spe oh, maybe a smuggler? What do we look like as a smuggler? Yeah, that's a bit better. I like that one. Yeah, smuggler's pretty good, right? Oh my god, look at Carolina. <laughs> look at everybody coming in. They're all so cute. I actually love this. <laughs> oh my god, look at them all. Um, I'm gonna come in and order some drinks. Let me order my favorite drink. What is our favorite drink? I'm not sure. What is Nina's costume? I'm not sure where Nina is. Is that Nina over there? No, that's how better. Who's this? Oh, Lennon looks so good. Can we just talk about how good Lennon looks? Holy, look how cute she looks. She looks so good. <laughs> okay, nobody's on board with my evil plan. I'll wait for my next opportunity. Wait, what mocker? What's the evil opportunity that you were thinking of? Why is her profile not loading in? Do I need to get her dress and then back into the outfit again? Is that what I need to do? Maybe I need to do that and then change it again. That's weird. Why is her favorite, like, drink wine? What is this, you fancy? Stop that. Order a different drink. You need a, you need a different favorite drink. Like, dim and dusty is what I imagined. Right, you need to get changed back into your outfit again. It's not loading her profile for some reason. I'm not sure why. Tinkerbell realness? Yeah. Oh, Spookfest was awful. I tried. I tried my hardest. Please. Change party costume. Wait, there's so many more on here. Oh my god, there's I think there's oh there's loads. Um zombie survivor? Let me see this one. Oh my god, that one's so cool. <gasps> I love that. Look at this, that's so cute. Erin, half a year and it's just the start. I love you all. Thank you so much, Erin, for the tier one for six months. That is crazy. Guys, could we get some claps, love, and hype in the chat for Erin? Honestly, Erin is so lovely, so supportive of us. She is just the loveliest person ever. So if you guys could give Erin some love, I would really appreciate it. <laughs> um, I'm going to get everybody in a group with me so that we can all start dancing together as well. Form group. Um... Right, I'll grab Carolina because she's probably one of my best friends. The drug dealer, sure. Luca, I really like. Lennon, Alveta. I'm really trying it on with these guys. Um, ooh. I need to give some of her co-workers a makeover because like, I can see this guy with a makeover. I can feel it. I can feel it. I'll grab Coda and Emiko as well because I do want friendships with these guys. These are pretty much all the guys that I really want to be good friends with. And then I'll go down to them. <laughs> okay. If Nina dresses an alien, I will cry. I don't know where Nina is. Um, I'm not I'm not really sure. Wait, I didn't know there was an upstairs. <gasps> no way. Wait. 
I didn't know there was an upstairs. No! I don't have the weed buds on me. Yeah, I do. Oh, it's because they're uncured. Oh. What about if I borrow some off of them? Wait, if I buy some from the drug dealer, can I do some upstairs? I can do some drugs with my friends upstairs if I buy some drugs off the drug dealer. Where's he gone? Let me grab him. Where is he? I don't know who he's dressed as. Uh, wasn't the drug dealer in like a massive outfit or something? Uh, where is he? Where'd he go? Luca, no. Oh, there he is. Right, um... Here we go. Drugs. Other requests. Drug dealing. Oh, okay. This is like to inquire about stuff. Buy drugs. Here we go. Hallucinogens. Buy cannabis. They aren't cured either. Wait, the ones that he gives me? Are you sure when I buy them? Oh, look at him hugging. She's hugging a drug dealer. That's so cute. I was in a drug dealer have like the best relationship on it. Oh, yeah. We hooked up with him, didn't we? Of course we did. <laughs> um, I'm going to buy the good stuff. I'm going to buy some purple haze this time. Oh, wait, actually, some sour diesel, too. I'll buy both. It's fine. Sure thing. Here you go. Grey day candy for adults. <laughs> um, go use the toilet, and then I'm going to see if I can go upstairs and try this with everybody. Wait, no, don't try it together. I want to put some in it. No, why can't I use it? One weed buds. Don't I have that? Oh, wait, have I got to open the bag? Oh, I've got to open the bag. I think that's why. I told you my sims and your sims are always avoiding each other. Here we go. Let me go use the toilet. I don't know where Nina is, honestly. I can't find her. Oh, there she is. She oh, she <laughs> I mean, you know, <laughs> she tried. It was a thought that counted. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to use these. I really... D oh, I can. Okay, sh I'll use the purple haste. Let me go put some in. Come, guys, let's go do drugs together. Let's go. <laughs> let's go upstairs on Halloween and do drugs. <laughs> this is like me living my criminal life playthrough. <laughs> what did Nina wear? Nina's wearing this. Um, this outfit here. I don't know where she is, though. She's there. I just I just uh, introduced myself to her. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, is everybody gonna come up? Oh yeah, she's changing the strain now, isn't she? Is she already drunk? Oh yeah, she's already tipsy. Love that for her. Let me uh, let me clear this up too. Here we go. Mocha, here's my chance. A hundred bits. Petition for Koda to be the baby daddy. We want those sweet, sweet jeans. I don't want Nikisa having any more children other than with the uh, the guy that she ends up with as a final. Like, she had, like, one child, and I feel like she's learned her lesson from that, from giving it up for adoption. So I really don't want her to have any more babies until she ends up... Um, until she ends up uh, with the final, you know, guy or girl, whoever she ends up as the final partner. Um, otherwise, I would be on board. <laughs> otherwise, I'd be on board with the sweet baby genetics of um of coda but you know we could always be friends like maybe have a thing maybe we could hook up with him two children you killed the other oh my god scarlet don't, <laughs> don't. okay look yeah admittedly nikisa she just makes some interesting decisions okay she shouldn't have got pregnant in the first place that was the issue come guys why is my drug dealer sitting here come on at least let other people get a chance at least let everybody else get a chance here. Oh, okay. Uh, Emiko's coming to sit with us. Let me talk to her. Good morning, cooking. Oh, thank her for coming. And I'm trying to work on my friendship with everybody. Remember, guys. I'm trying to be really close friends with everybody. So, uh, get to know Emiko too. Who are you? I don't think I've ever met you. Let me say hello. Question her costume. <laughs> okay, question her costume. Oh my, if she ends up with a girl, she could get IVF and uh, Koda could be the donor. That is an option as well. You had to crush on my hopes and dreams. <laughs> no chicken nugget for you. No. <laughs> oh, she's a pastry lover. Same though. Same. I've got to love a good bit of pastry. Oh my God. This is her sort of party. This is exactly what I imagined. Them in a barn getting high together. Exactly what I imagined from her and her friends. 
How's the stream been? What have I missed? We got some Redeemer Sims done at the start of the stream. We've been working on our relationship. She's now friends with um, Ask for Party Tree. Ooh. She's now friends with Lennon. And she's also friends with Carolina. And uh, who's the other girl? Aveta as well. She's, a, she's friends with all of them. So went pretty good. <laughs> Hi, Amy. Welcome to the stream. Here we go. Uh, is she going to compliment her outfit? What is that? Oh, that's a light. Okay. I was wondering why it was sticking to the floor. Oh my god. I think Emiko is just as bad. Emiko is just as bad as Nikisa. Oh my god. We're trying to be friends, okay? We're trying to be friends, not like mess with each other. How did she not find that funny? Like, she literally does that all the time. Oh, it's just so bring up. We need more drinks. We need more drinks. Guys, come downstairs. We need to order more drinks. No, where are you going? Where's the mixologist going? Get back there. We need more drinks. Go back there. Okay, great. Right, here we go. Right, order drinks. Order drinks for everyone. Here we go. Um, I will buy you all uh, Dim and Gusties because I kind of want that to be my favorite drink. What's this? Cannabis induced euphoria. Don't worry about a thing. <laughs> Wait, was she trying to? Oh, she was trying to play ping pong. No, I want a drink. Sayola with the prime sub for five months. Thank you so, so, so much for the five months and also happy anniversary. Guys, could we get some claps, love and hype as well? Lauren hit the two hour mark. I, I'm not going to, I'm not going to rush through if we hit the two hour mark. I think it's, I think it's okay. Ooh. Okay. Uh, Coda's talking to us, guys. Coda's talking to us. I think he wants to play juice pong with us. Um, I'm going to thank him for coming. Oh, okay. She's talking to Coda. There is the option for them to maybe hook up at some point. I want her to be safe about it this time. <laughs> it's about mischief with him. There you go. We told you so two hours and then you get into it. Look, okay. I will end after the after the party. After the party, I'll end. That's the deal. Oh, me and Emiko wearing the same outfit. That's dead cute. Stop <laughs> How's it going with Coda? She, I mean, she really does like Coda. For ages, she was like telling him about how good looking she thought he was. But he's feeling really uncomfortable, so it's probably not going to work out well. Oh, he's here to grab his drink as well, isn't he? Oh, um, I need to try talking to Lennon some more. Let me uh, thank her for coming. Can I compliment her outfit? I literally said to the other girl wearing this outfit that I didn't like it, and literally to Lennon, I'll be like, oh my god, I love that outfit. Like, just want to be friends with you. <laughs> compliment her costume. I'm gonna head out for the night. Bye, chat and Lauren. No worries, Olivia. I hope you have a good time doing whatever you're doing. Oh my god, her and Lennon. I was so excited for them to actually have a friendship, though. I I always saw them being friends, so when they naturally wasn't friends, it was a little like upsetting to me. But that's fine. I can work on it. I can work. Who's this? Ricardo. Oh, that's the other drug dealer. That's like the scuffed drug dealer, though. That's not the super good drug dealer. <laughs> Thank you. That's okay. That's no worries. Um, is she drunk yet? Is she even drinking her drink? Oh, yeah, she is. She is. Here we go. Um, it's like 9 a.m. And I started this party at like 2 a.m. So I'm thinking maybe I should end the party. What do you guys think? I'm really late. I'm sorry. That's okay, Queen Bee. Thank you for coming anyways. We appreciate you being here. Already have a taxi confirmed and on its way. No hour and a half wait for me tonight. That was honestly ridiculous, Erin. I actually can't believe you had to deal with that. I would have lost it. <laughs> yeah. Flashback to the time Lauren tried to get Nikita drunk with coke. <laughs> Look, I didn't know that it wasn't alcoholic, okay? I've never heard of it before. Was it soda? I think it was soda. It was like something soda, but we don't call it soda in, in the UK. We call it like like a fizzy drink. Like we don't call we don't call it soda, okay? Like we just don't. So it just it was it was weird, okay? It was weird. Wait, what oh she wants to swipe something in here? Good opportunity. I didn't even think about it. <laughs> um what can I swipe in here? Mm, I would love to swipe that. Can I swipe any of these posters? Damn it, okay. What else can I swipe? Um, nothing? 
Coca-Cola is a soda like Pepsi. Well, I know that now, but it's like <laughs> at the time. Yeah, I didn't know that. Oh, she can't swipe anything. She just recently got caught. Wait, I think she tried to swipe it and got caught. You're so embarrassing. Why did you actually do that in front of everyone? You literally tried to steal something whilst we were at a party. Like you threw a party at a venue and then tried to steal something from the venue. How messed up can you be? It was cream cola as in Coca-Cola. Yeah, but that's like not the same thing, right? That doesn't even sound like the same thing. Cream cola, Coca-Cola, they, they could be completely different things. <laughs> they could be completely different things, okay? It's warranted, right? It's warranted, right? Um, oh, I've got an idea. I want to try and build up my relationship with Lennon. And then I'm going to try and go against Coda and uh, uh, my drug dealer. Yeah, sure. I do know Coca-Cola. Okay, I know what Coca-Cola is, but not cream Coda. They are different, but both are just <laughs> soda. Look, okay? I wasn't getting it, okay? It's fine. We don't call it that here in the UK. We don't call it cream soda. We don't call it soda. We call it Coke. Like literally, if you said, can I have a drink? Uh, you wouldn't go and say, can I have a Coca-Cola? Nobody says a Coca-Cola. They, they, they do have Coca-Cola, but we never call it Coca-Cola. We only ever call it Coke. We literally just say, can I have a Coke please? It'll be like, can I have a Coke light? Can I have a Coke this? Or it'd be Pepsi. Yeah, which means that we never, like, we would never call it soda. Like, we would never go and say, can I have a soda? Like, nobody says that. <laughs> there is a cocktail called Cola with Rum and Citrus Juice. In the UK, that's called uh, Rum and Coke. It's still called Coke. <laughs> Madden, Ma uh, Madden Man with the Prime sub as well. Thank you so much. Guys, could we get some claps, love, and hype in the chat as well? We only say soda if we ask for soda water. Yes, exactly. We only say, can we have like the soda to put it in the water, uh, to put it in like alcoholic drinks normally. In Croatia, we just call it cola. Yeah, when I've been on holiday, I've gone and said a Coke and they've been like, and I've been like a Coca-Cola and they're like, oh, cola. And I'm like, yeah, Coke, <laughs> you know, same thing. <laughs> Yeah, I think in a, in a lot of European countries, you guys say cola instead of Coke. We normally say Coke. No, I've never been to Croatia. I would love to go, though. I would definitely love to go to Croatia. I think that'd be really fun. In the UK, we call it Coke. In Italy, we call it, um, we call it co uh, Coca or Coca-Cola. In Spanish, we call it Cola. We say, we say cola here. Yeah, I think a lot of you guys say cola. We only ever just say Coke. Okay, not, not Coda crying because he lost. <laughs> Who's actually gonna win? Are you kidding me? Who won? Wait, did she walk away? I'm so upset with you. I'm, oh, Nikita, I'm actually so upset with you. Fine, whatever. It's a, like, it's 12 o'clock in the afternoon and the party's apparently still going on. So we'll just, <laughs> we'll call it a day here. <laughs> there you go. Is she finally drunk? Yes, yeah, she was finally drunk by the end of the night. Exactly what I expected from her. Oh, you should definitely come. Honestly, it looks like a beautiful country. I would love to go. I really would love to go. Hey guys, so sorry I'm late. Hope everyone's okay. Hi, Elliot. How are you? What have you been up to? In Sweden, we say cola. That's so weird how like you guys, you know, aren't really that far away from me and you say like, you know, a completely different name for it. Like, you know, it's not that big of a difference. Like Coke and then cola is not that much difference, but still it's like, you know, in the US, a cream soda or cream Coke has ice cream added, which is like a root beer float. Wait, so it, like in these American like games, like like Sims, they call it like a root beer float. What is that? Is that like ice cream and then Coca-Cola on the bottom? Is that what that is? Can you say my name, Priscilla? Yes, it is. And to be honest, it's not that far from the UK. <laughs> yeah root beer and ice cream oh okay so it's something else on the bottom so wait what's root beer do we, we don't have root beer over here do we well, i've never seen it in a store before like i've never never gone to a store and had root beer or anything <laughs> it's usually vanilla wait like vanilla favored yeah we don't have no we don't have root beer i've never gone to a store and like seen root beer before <laughs> we don't have root beer it's not a thing that we have <laughs> Oh my god! Krusty! Baby! 
Okay, I'll take you to the vets. I'll take you to the vets. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to go to the vets drunk. Are you kidding me? This is so embarrassing. Can you try and sober up? Oh my god. Um, we'd love to have you join the island, girls. No thanks, I'm good. <laughs> Krusty even looks beautiful when he is all blue. Krusty needs some help. I'm taking Krusty to the vets, like ASAP. Krusty, we're going. You need the cone of shame, my boy. Let's go, honey. I'm taking you to the vets. Look at you, poor baby. <laughs> Look at him. Do you have the vanilla Coke? Yeah, so we have different flavors of Coke, but not that many. Um, normally when you go to like Five Guys, that's when I get all the flavors of Coke. So when I go to Five Guys, they do like vanilla, raspberry, like all these other flavors of Coke. But like when you go to shops, most of the time, you might be able to find like vanilla Coke, but that's normally it. Other than that, it's just normal Coke. Then there's like off brands of Coke. There's Pepsi, Lemonade, um, 7-Up. Um, I'm trying to think of what other drinks there are. Uh, Lucas Aid. I'm trying to think of what else you'd have. You'll have to try a root beer float. Do you think I'd like it? Somebody send Lauren some root beer stat. Vanilla Coke sounds disgusting. I really don't like it. I don't like vanilla Coke. <laughs> like, at all. Does that mean that I won't like root beer? Probably. It's probably the same thing, right? Oh, yeah. Actually, we do have cherry Coke. Cherry Coke's nice, too. I visited my nan in the hospital today and we found out she can come home soon. That's so exciting, Elliot. How was your day? It's been really good, thank you. I've been really productive as well. Got loads of stuff done, so. I honestly hate all soda, really. I don't like any cola. I love like sugary, uh, sugary fizzy drinks, but they're really bad for my uh, for my bladder. Like I, that's how I get sick all the time. So like whenever I'll drink one of those, it will make me sick like immediately. So I try like not to, you know, go near any of it. <laughs> um, okay, I need to sign Krusty in. Is she sick again? Oh my God, every single time she goes out and she meets up with people, she gets sick. Why is she fit? Oh, she's got caught. Right, she's still drunk. We've just turned up to the vets and she's still very drunk, but it's fine. It's whatever. We're here for Krusty and that's what counts. <laughs> Krusty, baby. Baby Krusty. Come here. Krusty. I love coffee. Okay, I hate coffee. Um, I think it tastes like dirt. I don't like coffee. <laughs> Have you ever had a cherry lemonade? No, never cherry lemonade. I don't drink fizzy drinks, but cherry coke is amazing. Also, Fanta lemon when you're on holiday. Oh my god, my, one of my favorite drinks. When I went to Mexico, they used to do lemonade, but it was like real fresh lemonade, like made with like, you know, real sugar and I think actually freshly squeezed lemons. I think it was called something in particular. Wasn't it called Mexican? Babe? Babe? You know when we went to Mexico and we had lemonade? Was it called Mexican lemonade? What was it called? Ben said lemonade El de Mexico. He just made that up. He's <laughs> such an idiot. <laughs> I don't really drink carbonated drink because I find it hard to swallow and it usually hurts to do so. Yeah, I could see that as well. I just kind of like the fizz of it, you know? Um, right, I'm gonna give I'm gonna give him the cone of shame because I can't really afford the expensive treatment. I'm gonna have no money. Go on, cone of shame, give it to him. Oh my god, Krusty! You're so cute! Krusty, baby! No! <laughs> Krusty, are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? He's probably so pissed off at me right now. I don't know. To be honest, even though Krusty doesn't like anybody that comes around to the house, Krusty is like really good. Like, um, Krusty's really good with like um, with Nikita. Has like a really good relationship with Nikita. I feel like maybe because she picked him up as a stray, you know. Um, I feel like that's where they got a good relationship. Have you ever had pineapple Fanta? No, I've only ever had like standard flavored Fanta. That's literally it. <laughs> it's kind of like chips and crisps. I live in Mexico, but I'm not sure what drink that is. No, Ben just made it up. But there is a particular, when I went to Mexico, there's a particular lemonade that was like, they didn't have the same lemonade anywhere else. It was like a like fresh lemonade like normally over here if you get lemonade it's not going to be like freshly squeezed lemon with sugar inside it it will literally be like a like a fake 
um artificial like lemonade like it has like a like a water it's like fizzy like fizzy water like soda i guess um with lemonade flavoring in it so like lemonade's okay but it's not real lemonade whereas when i went to mexico um that was like real lemonade like it was made with lemons and actual sugar inside it and honestly it was so it was so sugary but it was so good like i loved it <laughs> it was so yummy um, I'm gonna have a make uh, mac and cheese and then I'll have a go to bed. Actually, she's kind of on a, a slightly normal sleeping schedule because she didn't sleep last night. Uh, but she's gotta go back to a non-normal sleeping schedule again in a little while. <laughs> What's your favorite thing that you tried while in the US? Oh my god, there were so many good things that I tried in the US. I One of the, my favorites was definitely the 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 uh buffalo wings i love buffalo wings probably one of the things that i actually miss about it the most um if i could look back on it like admittedly i don't want to be that guy <laughs> i don't want to be that guy but there was a lot of food that i would much rather have eaten over in the uk Fishy. than i would have in america like there was some food that we don't have over here like the buffalo wings that you would never get in the uk but like for example chinese and indian your guys chinese and indian was like nowhere near as good as ours i don't know if it's because we have a lot more um in the uk we, we we've taken a lot more uh like oriental um uh, oriental foods so a lot of our like chinese and our indian actually come from chinese and india you know um and they come from chinese and indian people that have come over to the uk so normally the like the flavoring the flavoring of them and the businesses are actually run by chinese or indian people and they end up being so good um but i just found when i was in america they just didn't sh like shape up to be the uk's like chinese and indian like gotta admit <laughs> yeah it was like Ameri like american um, like there was some nice foods and admittedly you guys have got a lot more choice we don't have that much choice in the uk but i feel like the choices that we did have some of them were nicer yeah exactly i don't i don't think i've ever been to a chinese restaurant that wasn't owned by somebody who was chinese like over here it's the same with indian restaurants you never you never find indian restaurants that aren't owned by um like their native country you know <laughs> i eat chinese carry out or asian places all the time do you live do you live in america you do don't you Don't worry, whenever I'm in the UK, I miss the food in the US. Are you exactly the same? I feel like I feel like you always will be the same because it's like a home country, you know? Oh my god, Panda Express. That was so bad when I tried it in America. That was like nothing. Like it just wasn't it. Oh, uh, she's on a period again. Wasn't she just on a period like last stream? She literally comes on a period like all the time. Oh, I think it's because she had um I don't think her last one was a period. I think the last one was from the abortion that she had, you know. Um I think she came in a period after that. I think that might have been the issue. Okay, right. It's 20 minutes over my time. I really should go. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just going to end it straight after the party and then it just took a little bit longer. Just, yeah, just ignore me. It's fine. I'll give you a cute little, I'll give you a cute little look at Nikita. She's honestly like so annoyed all the time. Does she have a hangover actually? Oh no, she didn't end up with a hangover. Pretty good. My girl going to hold her drink. There we go. Get her while she's crying. Love that. Love it. So cute. <laughs> <laughs> we have so many types of buffalo wings but it's different based on the region in the u.s i've only been to uh florida so i wouldn't i wouldn't have tried any other ones but i would love to go to other places in america i'd love to go on like a like a travel like across america um at the time i wasn't allowed to drive in america because you've got to be 25 i think um to be able to get a higher car and obviously i was only 21 when i went to america actually was i even 21 i think i was 20 yeah i think i was 20 when i went to america i wasn't even yeah i was 20 because in america it's so weird because i went there and i couldn't drink and obviously in the uk i've been drinking since i was 18 so if i go out in the uk like it's been years that i've been drinking so i could just go to a bar as long as i got my id on me i can just order a drink and just drink in a bar or you know nightclub or whatever but in america it was so weird because you're not allowed to drink until you're 21 so because i was 20 i couldn't drink in america and i go and i go like i would just naturally go to the bar and like i'd be like oh my god a margarita i'd love a margarita and i go to go order it and be like wait i'm not old enough <laughs> yeah it's just weird it's just weird like the dynamic i think meanwhile people in europe have been drinking since they're 13 admittedly in the uk like we don't drink since we were 13 but like we've normally had like a tipple of alcohol before then you know like our parents have given us some at christmas or something so normally we have drunk before 18 
I love being able to drink in the UK before I turn 21. It's, yeah. And the fact that you can drive at 16, that is like crazy to me. Like the fact that you can drive at 16, but you can't drink until you're 21. Like the age differences between that is like, that's big, that's big, you know? <laughs> that is really weird. Um, right, okay. So I am gonna go ahead and end today's stream. Um, I went over my time by 20 minutes, so yeah, I uh, I shouldn't have, but it's fine. <laughs> so I will see you all again, not tomorrow, because tomorrow is my recording day, so I'm like, you know, recording all the videos for the rest of the week. Got to record Not Siberia 100 Baby. I'm going to post that that um, YouTube poll. If I'll post it up on Discord so you guys can come and vote for me. Um, let me know what you want me to do with the 100 Baby Challenge. Do you guys want me to start it again? Um, I could do it with Thalia or without. I'm going to put a post up to say whether you guys want me to restart the 100 Baby baby or continue it from where i am now and then i'm also going to put up another poll whether you want me to continue if if we choose to vote uh to restart whether you want me to continue with um dahlia or not i'll give you guys the options of what you want to do so uh yeah make sure you vote on that if you want to watch the 100 baby i am going to go check if there is anybody to raid um let me have a quick little look who have we got streaming we've got kayla um little simsy rochelle is streaming too Mm, who do you guys fancy oh there's loads of people streaming today who do you guys fancy uh raiding tonight oh yeah so uh so i won't see you tomorrow because i'm prepping videos so i'll see you all on wednesday wednesday i'm thinking guys what about if we work on that trailer park that that trailer park lot we'll do that on wednesday stream i think that's a good idea little simsy i think we've got more votes for little simsy right now kayla kayla okay two for kayla i'll, g I'll give it one more time see what we go for <laughs> Kayla? Do you mean candidly Kayla? Little Simsy? When you guys say Kayla, do you mean Kayla as in Little Simsy or candidly Kayla? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Which Kayla are we talking about? Let's say Little Simsy or Kayla, I guess. Little Simsy, okay. <laughs> Right, I will send you guys over to Little Simsy. I hope you guys have an amazing time over there. Make sure that you give Little Simsy some love. I'll meet you guys over there as well. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your evenings, uh, afternoon or mornings, whatever time it is for you. Thank you guys so much for coming. I love you all so much and I will see you all next stream. If you are new, if you want to go ahead and follow, um, I would appreciate it if you want to catch up with any of my streams, uh, any future ones. And that's all from me. I will see you guys later. And yeah, bye. Love you guys. Bye.